Alright guys, so I'm here at the track getting ready to do a uh, speed session. Uh, if you're familiar with Jack Daniels, um, you know, training style, I'm doing a repetition training. So I'm going to just do some fast repetitions on the track, work on that speed, work on that economy, strength training for runners, really, that's what it is, you know, working on that form, working on that uh, efficiency and getting more economical at higher speeds. So that's what we're doing today, putting on my Injinji toe socks. Of course, I use Injinji toe socks uh, to have my toes be able to wiggle naturally and do what they're supposed to do when I'm running. Of course, inside, I wear them inside my Ultra The One 2.5. I made a review of it uh, in the past, I'll link to it here. And so they're good. Um, it's a nice day, it's been hot lately, really really hot, so every run has been like a torture session in a way. But now, today, it's actually just 15 degrees Celsius, so it's nice and cool. So I thought I'd show you today, you know, a little bit from my session, what I'm doing, how I'm doing it. Uh, so, uh, let's do it! Alright, so we're rolling. Uh, we're just starting the warm-up. Let's talk a little bit about the session that I'm about to do. First, I'm just doing a 4K warm-up. So I'll just be running in the outer lane just to make the, the, the track as long as possible. I'm just gonna run easy for like, you know, 20 minutes or so. All right, so warm-up is done. I finished off with a couple of uh, strides just like accelerating for like 30 meters max speed almost for like 30 meters and then just decelerating for another 30 minutes uh, 30 meters and uh, so that's just to activate those fast twitch muscle fibers a little bit and uh, get them ready for what's to come now which is the speed session anyway uh, i'm ready to start the workout uh, today we're doing three times 200 meter repetition pace so that's that's kind of like mile race pace probably fast running for 200 meters then i'm gonna walk for 200 meters as a recovery another 200 meters walk another 200 meters so three times 200 meters followed by two times 400 meters at the same pace so that's going to be a little tougher longer repetition but the same uh, pace and then we're gonna finish up with three times 200 meters on the end and of course bear in mind that this is my second ever workout like this so I'm keeping it on the conservative side in terms of volume but uh, still you know working pretty hard so let's look at the paces I'm gonna work on at so you know somewhere between 43 and 44 seconds per 200 meter that's probably what I'm gonna aim for and it's really about working on form and increasing that running economy through strength training, which is essentially what is stiffening up some of the tendons uh, and, and sort of making all the other paces feel easier. I don't know if it's because of the temperature today, it's cooler, or because of uh, the gains that I've had from last week's sessions, but I'm, my, my warm up now, my, my, my heart rate was much lower uh, relative to pace than it usually is. So. Certainly something is going on. I'll probably gain a little bit from the workouts as well as, of course, um, the fact that it's cooler today and I've been heat acclimatizing for three weeks now. All right, anyway, I'm gonna get to it. I'm gonna sort of, I have a tripod here and I'm gonna sort of do things uh, during the workout just to show you guys um, what I'm up to and how it looks. Uh, but I'm gonna focus mostly on the workout and then we're gonna talk afterwards. All right, let's do it. I definitely went out a little bit too fast on the first one and the second one, typical. I'm gonna reel it back a little bit. Um, when it comes to the recovery, you know, it's uh, these uh, repetition sessions, it's really, like I said, strength training. So it's pretty hard work and it's focused on the mus muscles, really, not the cardiovascular system. So you want to have pretty long breaks, uh, long recovery periods, about you know two to three times as long as the 
the work bout. So I'm working for 44 seconds, then I'm taking about 90 seconds or a little more, uh, walking, resting, talking to you guys, and then it's time to get back for another repetition. Let's do it. All right, it's time for a 400 meter now. Let's put the camera here so you guys can see me coming in. Way too fast. Oh my god. I really have to work on pacing. I mean, it's difficult for me. I'm not used to these fast paces. So I end up running a bit too fast. I did the I did the 400 meter rep in uh, 114. So that's definitely in my first. That's my fastest 400 meter ever, I think. Pretty fast. I should be moving, not talking to you guys. So I'll be moving and then I'll do another 400 meter rep. One twenty-five. That's more like it, but holy fuck, it's tough. Oh. All right, it's time to go back to the two hundred meters. We're doing the last three two hundred meter reps. That's the that's the that's the last of the workout today. Uh, I'm gonna do them the other way around. That's it. That's the workout. Ah, oh, feels so good to run hard. <laughs> I love it. I mean, I've been running slow and steady for a few years now, not doing much fast running like this. And it just feels good to feel those limits, you know, to feel myself pushing really hard and to see the results, you know, that's also nice. I think the workout went pretty good. I consistently ran too fast though few seconds too fast whether that's because that's actually my appropriate pace you know maybe it's maybe I'm fitter than I think I am and I should be running at that pace or maybe I'm just running too fast you know faster than I really need to which uh, is not a good idea so uh, probably a little bit too eager since I had the camera with me and stuff uh, that's a very typical scenario for me um, but I'm happy about the workout it was a nice it's a nice workout feels good I'm tired now now I'm gonna do a cool down just like two kilometer super easy jog around the track just clearing you know helping to clear some of that lactate through the muscles some of that adrenaline uh, etc and just uh, yeah start the recovery process really I have a lot of water in my bag I'm gonna drink some of that and then I'm gonna head to the car and get my bananas course and I'm gonna sit down and eat bananas and I, and I have a strength training workout later today so this is a hard day but I like to make my hard days hard and my easy days easy so today's a hard day so it's Fridays but the rest of the week I'm running pretty easy and uh, of course on Sundays I'm doing a long run which is easy but hard because of the volume of course all right here we are back at the bag the water Hey, thanks for watching. Thanks for uh, joining me. If you have some thoughts about my workout, some uh, and anything you want to say, comment down below. Let me hear it. I'm looking forward to the coming weeks doing more track sessions like this. I'll take you with me again and again, for sure, uh, on the whole journey. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe to this channel if you haven't done so already. If you have done it already, if you have subscribed already, you can click the little bell button next to the subscribe button, and that way you'll be notified each time I upload a video. So go ahead and do that if you're already subscribed. All right, have a good day. Hope your running is going well. See you around.